This is just another quick video on the Stepcraft UNC software and yet another problem with it. So if we go into CAM, um, there's a thing for importing DXF files. It doesn't work. I've never been able to get it work. I've tried many different programs, many different settings, many different files from different years, all the way back to the 90s. Nothing opens in it. For example, this is just a square and a circle. From, you've probably seen in my other video. If we uh, open it, it comes up with some error. Sometimes it doesn't even come up with an error, it just won't open, or it'll pretend it's opened it, it'll just be blank. Um, I've given up trying to uh, get it to work. So instead what we've done is we've downloaded this program. Uh, it's called SLCAM. Let me just close that so you can see it opening from, uh, from scratch. I think SLCAM, I think it's uh, German so if we go file open uh, this is the same AutoCAD file um, that the other program refused to open open it and boom lo and behold it works perfectly because it is a perfectly good file it's just that the UNC software is a bit crap so we go into uh, for me I go into engraving you may want to do something different depending on what you're trying to do with it if you like cutting engraving whatever i set my uh set my uh tool depth etc etc loads of settings in here um i don't really know i'm not a cnc expert but anyway i click on here i've got a start depth i've got tool path depth I've got 2.8 sure do that one as well okay and then when i'm happy with it i File, uh, save CNC program, um, and um, basically give it a name, and then it's going to give a timer because I'm cheap and I haven't paid for it. But um, if we if we get success from this project, we probably will pay for it because relatively to industry software, that's not that expensive, and if it does the job. I'm happy to do it. Uh, something else that's worth noting is uh, there's a little thing here to set the zero point. That's quite useful. Um, so you base at the moment it's set this is the origin. So if I zero the machine, it will start cutting from there. That's fair enough. Uh, I'm happy with that. But you may need to change that. Um, if we um, I can actually show you one that I did earlier. So. What we'll do then is we'll go into run on uncnc load file um, square circle ngc this is basically the format that it will generate when this time is run out um, and it will open just like that and then um, i'm going to just uh, set up my axes so i'm just gonna lower that down a bit to there uh, and then I'm going to uh, zero all and then I'm going to uh, press cycle start in just a second uh, cycle start give it a minute Yeah, picture. 